comrades of the Soviet Union. Almost one year has passed since the German invaders set foot upon the soil of our motherland. They have advanced deep into the Soviet Union, capturing city after city, raping, murdering, and robbing the Soviet people. Although our situation grows desperate, we have one last hope of defense. The city that bears our great leader's name, Stalingrad. Comrades, many of your countrymen are already there, defying the Germans at every step. Soon, you will stand alongside them, and you will not fail to defeat our fascist enemies. No one shall take even one step backwards. Commissars will execute cowards on sight, giving faithful soldiers a chance to do their duty. The Motherland is counting on you to achieve victory at Stalingrad. Comrades, this day will be the proudest day you have ever lived. You will fight the fascist Nazi invaders with all your strength. For each and every fallen Soviet soldier, you will make them pay with ten of them. There will be no mercy for defeatists, cowards, or traitors. Anyone caught deserting his post will be shot. Remember great Comrade Stalin's order. Not one step backwards! You will be well equipped for the battles that lie ahead. You will have food, water, weapons, and plenty of ammunition. What do you suppose the Germans have? Their supply lines are stretched too thin. Their dash to the Volga has left them without the means to bring us a proper fight. Go, Phil! 
I sent for that rest car over there. Wait for them to change out their mirrors. Ready? Okay, go, go!
will report to him from here on out.
of the Soviet Union. There is no need for the standard of bloodshed between our nations. The German people are not your enemy. If you surrender, you will be treated well. You will be given plenty of food.
Stay in the ditch and keep your head down. They've got snipers out there. Private Kovayenko, as the fastest man here, you will be debate. Me? Oh, no, thank you, comrade. That is an order! Alexei will cover you with the sniper rifle from here. Now go, before I shoot you myself!
Comrade Alexei, we've got those anti-tank rifles on the second and third floor. You take out the tanks. We'll stop the troops. Here they come! Ready on the anti-tank rifles! Anti-tank rifles ready! Machine gun!
door open. I hear that our Move generals in. are racing to Berlin. Down. The general who gets to Berlin live for re-education. We'll be re-educated with them if the NKTD hears us.
still alive? Well, good. That's good. Good for you. We must get out of here, quickly, before the artillery starts.
We have to get off to that room! Get the shot! Mother, a few days ago, we waved the flag of the motherland over the top of the Reichstag in Berlin. The war, at last, seems to be coming to an end. There is very little fighting left in the enemy. Soon I will be returning to our home. There are German prisoners of war everywhere. Today, I crossed the Elbe River in Germany and shook hands with an American soldier. Although I could not understand anything he said, I felt this man was my brother. And I think he felt the same.